Hey there, in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to change the date format in your BigCommerce store. Uh, before we get started, my name is Cal. I am a developer, store owner, just like you, and I run an online community for people like us. There'll be a link at the end. Let me show you where to find this. Okay, so when you log into your store, you go to settings, settings, for real, uh, and then go to, oh, date and time zone. There's a link right there under the general tab. Now, when you get in here, it says date settings, display date format, and then it says some weird stuff. J, capital S, space, capital M, space, capital Y, and there's also some other weird stuff in here for extended, di dis extended display date format. And if you click over, the, if you hover over the little tooltips, that's what they call these little question mark dot guys, it says the default extended date format used in your extended in your e-commerce store. So this is used some places. The regular display date is, is used in other places. But it, both of them say the same thing, which is to change the date format. See this php.net slash date site. Sorry, I'm trying to, trying to keep it hovered. All right, so when you go to that site, php.net slash date, it takes you to this thing. It's super Cody, it looks crazy, right? Scroll down until you see this section right down here that says example for date formatting. And this is pretty much going to be your, your shortcut to sanity because you can look at all these examples that they have here and look at how they output on the screen and see which one of these you're looking for. Now you can technically use these, um, you know, these letters and things to change how it looks and how it's spaced, whether you have a comma and all that kind of stuff. Um, but you can kind of see that each of these things corresponds to uh, an aspect of the date, right? So capital Y is for date year. Capital F is your spelled out month. Whereas lowercase m is your decimal version of the month and you can see that we got decimal dot decimal day dot decimal year equals march 10th 2001 now if you're in a fancy part of the world and you do days in front of months then you could take this same formula and just switch this around to be d dot m dot y and then it would show the 10th of 3 2001 just like that so <clears throat> Let this be your cheat sheet that kind of shows you, you know, most of the most of the ways you probably would want to look at it. And you're going to take this or whatever, you know, moved around version of this that you want and take, you know, take this, for example, if you wanted to show like this, come back into your big commerce store, paste it right here. If you're doing the regular date or if you're doing the extended date, which is usually when you have like the hour, the time stamp in addition to the day then paste that right here. All right, so hopefully that helps. Um, you will have to get in there and, and you know, see how the course, the, the letters and, and the, you know, the decimals and all that stuff correspond to the, the day and the time format that you're looking for. But that's kind of the decoder ring here is on php.net slash date. And once you get figured out how you wanna move these letters around or whatever, then just paste them in here and click save. All right, hopefully that helped you guys. Leave me a comment. If so, leave me a comment. Let me know what you guys are stuck on. If you're interested in joining our community, check us out at ecommerceamplifiers.com. And if you need to you know, look at hiring a dev like me and my team, check us out at epicdesignlabs.com. We'd love to hear from you.